Hey guys, it's Remo, and here's this week's update from our team. Our story for today is regarding my new shoes. They don't look like they're the greatest looking shoes, but they're the most comfortable. And so we're gonna uh, label this video once upon a schedule. So I personally been experiencing some, some foot pain on my left foot and it's called plantus fasciitis, I think is what it's called. Um, and so, you know, what does that mean? So I asked the doctor, hey, I have some foot pain. And so, um, you know, one of the great things about being married is my wife, she washes my Nikes, right? So I always have clean looking Nikes all the time. The problem with that is you're supposed to be changing your shoes more frequently. And to my knowledge, uh, I didn't know that. And so doctor says, well, you need more support on your foot. And so he, he says the best shoes for that is typically Skechers because they have a lot of padding, a lot of cushioning and a lot of support. So that's where now I wear these. And I could tell you, you know, maybe it's either age or this or that, these shoes are damn comfortable. So if you ever see me with Skechers and not Nikes, um, you know, doesn't matter because I'm really comfortable in these new shoes. So uh, I guess the, 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 the story or the metaphor for today is, you know, as we kind of progress through life, there's certain things that maybe we didn't think were gonna eventually be our time. Because um, in the past when I used to see people wear Skechers, you know, they're not as cool as Nike looking or some Jordans or whatever shoes you like. Um, but I could tell you from first-hand experience, you're definitely comfortable. So you definitely will see me with more Skechers. I, I try to find the most discreet looking ones, right? It only says Skechers there, um, but you know, whatever. Uh, anyways, let's get started. Um, we want to congratulate uh, one of our sellers that uh, closed the last week. We, they're going to be relocating to North Carolina. So uh, Ernie and, and Janet, congratulations, guys. They're going to be moving out officially in about a week and a half. So and making the trip up uh, again to the Carolinas. So congratulations, guys. Uh, we want to congratulate Martin that just got uh, his offer accepted with Alina from our team on this beautiful, beautiful home in Pomona. I mean, just just stunning home. So congratulations in about three weeks or so. We'll be giving you keys. Uh, we also want to remind you for our past clients or current clients that are uh, what is it called? Our pumpkin painting party is happening October 20th. So with it less than a week, we're going to take over a pumpkin patch. Again, COVID friendly. We might actually be pretty close to sold out or, or, or all the spots that take uh, accounted for because of limited capacity. So if you haven't already RSVP, please do so as soon as possible. Um, I think that we might have even switched to a waiting list um, um, just recently. So if you're interested, please let us know. Let me read my notes here. We have our home buyer workshop this Saturday in person. That's right. We get to see you. You get to feel our energy and all that. Um, so it's happening this Saturday. Uh, there'll be uh, info for the workshop uh, somewhere in this email or this post. Uh, we also have a few homes that are on the market or are going to be hitting the market. One is an East Whittier. It's a three bedroom, two bath on Hester. Uh, it's going to be listed at $699. Um, really good looking house, uh, freshly painted inside, outside. So open house this Saturday, Sunday. We also have our Spanish style home that was on, that hit the market less about a week ago. Uh, we should be, we'll be having open house on it as well this weekend. And uh, we have uh, and a really exciting opportunity, a duplex, right? That's right, duplex. You don't hear them as often, especially in this market. And in this case, it's new construction duplex or fairly new, it's within the last five years in Uptown Whittier. So that's like a unicorn if you've ever spotted one of those new construction in Uptown Whittier because they don't exist. And so we found the one and uh, it'll officially be going on the market probably in a couple weeks. It's two units. Uh, each unit I believe is three bedroom, three bath, about 1800 square feet and each have their own two car detached garage. Um, so if you're interested in that, please let us know. Uh, with that, we want to say thanks for your continued support. We're excited to see our past clients at our pumpkin painting party and uh, we'll see you guys soon.